Good morning. Hi everyone. It's Friday, Janice. Yes. yes. Welcome to Free Tip Friday. I know. I'm so excited to be sharing with you. And the happiest of birthdays Thank to you, you today. Thank you so much. And you? everyone, look at the lovely, lovely necklace that Kate made me. Oh, so, it was just a few little bubbles. I know, but it's so little nice. Bubbles. It has a 12 on it and it has a J on it yeah. and it has a what is the key that's that a that's a typewriter key that says doesn't say reject no it says shift shift key. yes yes <laughs> key because Which is, um, we're shifting yes we're shifting into a new gear i'm yeah. moving and you're you're becoming, moving you're a partner and she's and moving i'm moving everyone yeah <laughs> i did know that yes i know it's so yeah. so many good things i got and look lovely at flowers brought you some some tulips yeah. and and Louise, Louise our look newest at, team uh, member from her garden, both from their gardens. Yes, thank you look for all the lovely wishes from everyone. There's it was so nice yeah, really waking nice up. I didn't have my phone, I left it at the office, which was kind of nice because mm -hmm. then I had to do everything just visually, no yeah. sound. But thank you so much for um, wishing me a happy birthday. Yeah. That really, really touched my yeah, heart. It was, it was really very, nice. Yeah. We also posted yesterday, if you look on our Facebook page, and you probably have seen it because you are on, on our Facebook Live page now, Facebook page. Cara, oh thanks, Janice. Oh, you're welcome. Cara made you the most delicious raspberry trifle. Oh, yes, it was delicious. It was a trifle in a yes. trifle bowl. I it know. was so fantastic. And it's put a trifle few pounds on well, it. Well, it was so delightful. trifly hip. So you can see it uh, <laughs> on our Facebook page. It was really, really yes. lovely. So happy birthday. Thanks, happy, happy, birthday happy birthdays from everyone. Oh, Thank you. Thanks, yes. guys. Thanks, guys. <laughs> and of course, Grace is filming us today yeah. because we've got kind of an epic thing we're going to share. Yeah. So let me jump right in because, okay. you know, we, we don't want to make it short and forever. Yes. So even though we feel like we just want to hang out on Fridays with you guys. I but know. what are we going to do? Let me get a drink of my gin. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. It's just water. <laughs> but um, I don't know where that came from. Um, but we're going to talk about necklace length. Yes. And first, what I want to go over before you jump in and, and talk about why you did this, you are kind of famous for, uh, for necklace right. length. You're all speaking this up. Hurry up. Yeah, come but on. You're famous. Everyone doesn't want to hear this. But they do want to hear it. <laughs> Why are you so famous? I, I, I'm not sure. You're going to tell us. <laughs> why? All right. Well, why? so way back when we had our brick and mortar store, bead shop, uh, the bead shop in Palo Alto, Janice was known for making these beautiful necklaces and stuff, right? So that was kind of the, the early 90s when former president George Herbert Bush yes. was in office. Right. And some of you may remember that first, then First Lady Barbara Bush was known for her pearls. Correct. Right? Correct. So, so, and this went viral before going viral was a thing. It was picked up by the AP. Yes. That you were traveling back to, it was a... I was going to the a... The Bead a, Museum. A, a, no, there was, <clears throat> there was a bead conference in Washington, D.C. Right. And I thought that we could, I wanted to offer to restring Barbara's pearls mm -hmm. because they were too they, were close. they were just yeah like they needed a little air mm -hmm. a little air so I wrote a letter mm -hmm. to Barbara um, and I got a very nice reply from someone <laughs> saying thank you but no thank you right and then at the time um, uh, Winnie who was yeah. working with us she had a great idea of sending Millie the first dog a necklace made of eucalyptus pods because they ward off fleas. Mm -hmm. So we did send a letter, uh, the letter, and then we sent the, the necklace. Millie necklace. And then it got picked up. Yeah. Somehow it got picked up. It went that viral. we were coming to Washington <laughs> and that we were bringing a necklace for Millie yeah. made of eucalyptus pods. Yeah. It was great. It was we really still have fun. the clippings. We'll yeah. have to find it somewhere. Yeah. It was yeah. picked up by the AP. It was yeah. great. So Janice has been known for necklace, necklace measuring length. Yes. and necklace lengths. Forever. It's so important. So I think people wanted to hear that, and they, even if yeah. it's a good thank you piece of lore. So, but this was the necklace. So this is the necklace that got me started, started on this journey of necklace length. Mm -hmm. I made this. Uh, I want to say in the mid '80s. Yeah, because you've had that. Necklace it, I've had this forever. really forever. But why? Why don't I wear it? So, Why don't you wear it, Janice? So let me show you. So I can even show it with this yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. So this is... Here, and I'll hold it. So okay, so this is down. this is what the length... Whoops, I, you dro got the, I dropped it. Okay, so this is the length I made it. Can everyone see? 
Oh yeah, lovely necklace. It looks so pretty. Okay, now bring it up, please. <laughs> now, think, now look yep. at it. Right. And That's what I right used length. to say to all of our customers and students, don't look at the necklace. Look at your face and what the difference does. So I'm just going to bring it. I'll, let me just. Do, I'll mm -hmm. do it. So I'm going to bring it back to where it was here. Don't I look droopy? Everything's droopy on me. Then all I do is I lift it up like that and magic. Yeah, magic. Look at that. Mm -hmm. yep. Just, I, I'm 10 years younger. It's like a good bra. Well, you've got good skin. <laughs> it is. It's like, it's a, like good, a good it's bra. It's like a good it bra. It lifts you up. It does. So all of you yes. out there who have jewelry that you're not wearing, <laughs> if there's <laughs> All of you out there who have droopy jewelry. <laughs> There's Don't two reasons you're not wearing it. It's either the wrong length mm -hmm. or it's the wrong color for you. Right. And you either have to shorten it or lengthen it or you have to give it away. Right. And but you're not going to wear it mm -hmm. if it's the wrong length. If it's the wrong length. You just won't. And so today, you guys may remember from our Wednesday broadcast, we did our sketch and necklace that um, Grace and Janice put together. And one of the things that Janice and I, when we would team teach, kind of like we're going to be doing along with Emily in our upcoming retreat, but Janice and I would do, we would do like a beginning stringing techniques class or we'd do some advanced stringing, but this was like the big takeaway from the students that everyone would get measured right. and you have three necklace lengths. I so think the so. Right lengths I think people. so. So we really wanted to share that with you because we thought it really dovetailed nicely with Wednesdays. Um, soft flex broadcast that we did that epic broadcast and looking forward to part two when we um, broadcast on Wednesday all about you know kind of the design of what we mm -hmm. did so this is kind of a good kind of middle ground so you guys can see um, how to how to measure so you can always measure with a friend and you can download of course the sketch and necklace from um, the uh, Facebook page, from the Softlex Facebook page on our website, beachhop.com. Grace, it sounded like you had a question. Uh, Mimi wants to see a close up of your necklace, Janice. Oh, oh okay. I think oh, the one you're oh, wearing. This one. Oh, okay. Well, are we going <laughs> to okay. stand up? Yeah, or we'll let's stand transition. Up. So let's do it. Okay. Let's do let's transition. <laughs> so, the first thing when we oh. get in place. What's that? Sorry, um, oh, yeah. Patrice just says that she has her copies and she's ready to start working with it this morning. Oh, oh that's great. Great. Okay. great, Patrice. So the first thing I would like... And then we'll get an up close of Janice's okay. yes. So the first thing that we want to do is everyone out there, you need to have a tape measure. Yes. Okay. And the way you measure is from the back of the neck, if you're going to do this at home, and then you bring it down to where it is in front. Mm -hmm. so, so don't try and put it on in the back like this would be the class. Right. Your ends are in the front. So for this... You're pulling me forward. Oh, I'm so no, sorry. It's okay. no, so no. for this, the necklace would be a 24. Okay. I'm just saying. Mm -hmm. Or if you wanted it shorter, I'm here to here is it 18. 18. 18. Oh. Okay. Okay. But to go this way, to bring it into the back, is deceiving and it doesn't really tell right. you. you can't tell. You can't really tell. So the measurement you're going to, oh sorry, I'm no, it's you, okay. Is the end of the tape measure to the front. If you don't have a tape measure, a piece of string will work, mm -hmm. um, and then you could lay it down with a yardstick. Right, and measure it that way. Um, you could also take uh, eight and a half by eleven paper, lay them down. You know, each one is eleven mm -hmm. inches. Take your piece of string, mm -hmm. but it, it is possible. But go, yeah, go get, go get a tape. Go get a tape measure, you guys. But I so have been places where I didn't have one, well, and I had to figure out. Oh, help that length, and I would right. take the design well, that's board. That's how I measure it. wire. Yes. I always have my finger with see? me, see? and my finger is three inches. See, yeah, this is a, this is ear wire length. Right see, here. yeah, that's true. We're, we're crafty. Okay. So the way you start, do you start with the beads, or do you start with the tape measure? I I, I do only use the. I'm just saying, if you needed to measure oh, okay. on yourself, okay, that's how you do it. But I start with the beads. Okay. And if you have a strand of. Even if you went and got Mardi Gras beads, mm -hmm. anything, mm -hmm. inexpensive beads, this I took three strands of these really pretty pearls, pearls. which we're going to start I'm selling soon. I can't um, see. And oh. just something that isn't really like design heavy. Right, or okay? distracting. Distracti and so you put Where this around going? your neck. Okay. And um, it's best to have no collar. Okay. So the, and, and we're going to go look in the mirror now. We have so a mirror. 
And so when you're at home, so so Kate, okay. Okay. So I don't want you to look at the beads. Okay. I want you to look at your face. Okay. Just watch your face. Okay. And you normally wear earrings. I do. So you want to do this when you have earrings on. Mm -hmm. It may change a little bit. But what I do to start out is I just go up. I go up. Oh. And then I go down I like again. That. Mm -hmm. And there are going to be some places where mm -hmm. you go, oh, right, that's oh, what I like. Oh, I love that. I love it. Okay, so let's mm -hmm. do that again. Okay. Just nice and slow. Okay. Look at your face. I like, I like that length. Okay, I'm not making it, we're not okay. deciding yet. We're still okay. just, we're we're just, still just going twice. Okay. But I do like mm -hmm. this that, on you. That Look length. at that on you. Mm -hmm. Look it's at good that. Length. That is just really nice. Isn't and you it? can see how it frames, especially with my earrings that I've got going on here. And it's I've got a little bit of space. So this mm -hmm. is what jewelry is supposed to do. Mm -hmm. Necklaces are supposed to frame our face. They're supposed to make us look beautiful. That's mm -hmm. their job. Ooh. That is what we do. That's why jewelry has been mm -hmm. worn for centuries. Is not only you know to say what your rank is in society. Right, but it's like I, I'm wearing emeralds, so right. I must be the pharaoh. Mm -hmm. But it's also to say this is who I am. Mm -hmm. So um, we're going to start again. Mm -hmm. And so we'll start, I think, with your short length because okay. that was one. You start with the one, doesn't matter long or short or middle, mm -hmm. that you go, ah. Mm -hmm. So let's let's go back up to the one where okay. we had the ah. My aha moment. Your aha moment. Yeah. Right I can there. And I can feel you it. You can feel it, right? Mm -hmm. So now what I'm going to do On the back is there. I'm going to uh, bring it. I'm going to, so I'm going to stay here. Okay. And I'm going to let you bring it down to the front. Okay. Let me just straighten this out. Mm -hmm. And you tell me what that point is. So bring them together. So I'm bringing it around. Yeah, and kind of so pull it a little tight. Like this about, yeah. right? Yeah. So I think it's about 19. 19? About 19 inches, which okay. is about right, I think. Right. I mean, it's so a familiar I'm number put to me. 19 down, mm -hmm. okay? Okay. And then let's just see if we go a little shorter how that looks. No. Mm -mm -mm. See, it just... Nope, my neck got 10 years older. Hmm. But that's also pretty That's a good you. length, right? That's a good length. And so let's go around again. I like that length. This, for me, is just an inch longer right. at 20. So whenever you're making about, a necklace, the yeah, other trick 20. is you always start with the one closest to your neck. Mm -hmm. I don't care. If I were making a multiple strand, you right? you go with the inner one first because and that's then the most down. important. Exactly. How does it make you look mm -hmm. around your face? Not how long is it going to go? Because it's this measurement that dictates everything else. Everything else. Okay. Mm -hmm. So now I'm going to say maybe there's a middle length. So let's start again. Let's okay. go down one more time. That's a no. No. Yeah, no. I don't think. No. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go up a little. That's okay. What do you think? Whitney is asking mm -hmm. if the length would depend on the cut of the shirt you're wearing, scoop, v-neck, etc. Yes, it can. It, it can. can, yes. Which is why, like, let's say that this were like a boat neck or something here, maybe, would be. See, you're, the nice thing, I mean, mm -hmm. yes, you have a v-neck mm -hmm. on, so, like, we wouldn't want to do a v-neck it, with this, I wouldn't want to see you wearing something that was just like right there. Mm -hmm. It's just like they're fighting each mm -hmm. other. You either go longer or go shorter. Mm -hmm. um, and then we could just maybe sketch a little bit about the neckline. Mm -hmm. But I'm just, again, I'm looking at your face. Mm -hmm. And oh, I good, think you could wear length. this length. Yeah. I wouldn't put a pendant on it mm -hmm. for you. But mm -hmm. I think you could wear this mm -hmm. length. Whitney's asking how do you accommodate for, I'm assuming, the neckline. For the, uh, um, we'll talk, we can talk about that in just a second. Okay. That's about 28 and 28, a half. yeah. So and you have, you have three lengths and then would you ever go yeah. like long? I would. You would, okay. Mm -hmm. so and, sorry, real oh, quick, yeah. Melanie's saying, can we look at a lariat length on Kate? A lariat. Oh, sure, we could. 
A lariat. Okay, so a lariat would be two ends, like mm -hmm. a. Okay, mm -hmm. so we can design with that. Yes. So let's just go. Mm -hmm. Is that a little too long for you? It feels a little. Maybe. Uh, uh, I don't know. You cut. It kind of is nice on yeah, you. Yeah, I agree. I don't know how we got there, just perfectly. <laughs> but I it, like it too. Yeah. No, yeah. that's. It's because it's three pearl strands. Yes, Gracie Grace. Yes. Okay, let me. Yes. Let's measure. So that. Nancy's asking, what if you're making a necklace for somebody else? You could make it adjustable by putting a three inch extender on it mm -hmm. and so we'll, that they can, you would go to maybe uh, a shorter necklace, like make it to 15 and then add a three inch extender so that it comes out to, they could make that first one as long as 18. Mm -hmm. um, I think yeah, that we're almost a nice. second free tip Friday on mm -hmm. this. There's so many things about necklaces. And this lines. is about 48, which is about yeah. what I make my pieces. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Adair is asking, mm -hmm. and I'm sorry if I pronounced your name wrong. She said she's digging the super long lengths that she's been seeing almost to the belly button length, mm -hmm. layered with shorter, shorter lengths. And then her question gets cut off. Would mm -hmm. would it just be the length closest to the neck that I should be concerned? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That's what you start with. And then take your cue from everywhere else. Like my buddy Candy Cooper, who does, some of you guys watch her Facebook Live. Candy does this really cool, uh, a lot of that kind of boho kind of look stuff. And she just layers and layers. The thing that you want to be careful of when you do longer boho, I look so respectable in these you pearls. You do. Very nice. Um, oh, <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know myself. What she does, though, is she makes sure that what she's wearing doesn't hit like her belt buckle or because she likes to wear also kind of kind of like a vintage kind of cowboy chic kind of look too so you want to be careful about getting too long if you're having like you know belt buckles or other things but yeah take your cue from that long this length mine was 48 and then layer from there this kind of looks good, huh? It does look good. My double Maybe, strand. Yeah. So you could do something like that. There, I'll kind of do this. And wow, that looks great. Looks great. Now I'm just going to wear. And so see, like if I did, yeah. I don't want to expose myself too much, you guys. But let's say that I altered my neckline here. And so the neckline was a little more straight across like this. You can see that something like that really works. And so what you could do, I don't know who had the question about the shirt or the... Whitney. The, Whitney, the... the line of your shirt but you could like I could even like put, put this dress on backwards and have like a higher neck you know and I could kind of do it you know kind of like this to have my straight across neck you know so you can kind of try different things on but this looks great I think yes question yes Louise is asking what about pendants being added would you have large or small um, that's what she asks but I'm also assuming would you make it shorter or longer depending on the length of the could pendant someone get me a disc one of the pie discs so what I like to do... High disc, stat. stat. So what I like to do is I also work... This is totally I, fun. Are you having fun? Yeah. I'm having a lot of fun. I, I also like to work the disc in or the pendant in mm -hmm. to about the length. So, right. So if that pendant is going to go lower than my ideal length... Thanks. Okay, thank you. So hold that up to the shorter one. <laughs> okay. I'll put this back. Okay. So you could stay within your length but now put it below the longer one it doesn't do it first no, of all it here, doesn't show but right. it shows up and so then i would probably make the second strand longer so that it includes the pendant on the first one so the pendant would go to mm -hmm. the second length that you measured and then you could go a, a little longer so this mm -hmm. i would put like this there. here this mm -hmm. kind of goes to your ideal length mm -hmm. and then that one goes below mm -hmm. it. So right, so if I lifted this, if we went to my ideal length for just this, let's right. do a single. Nope. Oh, oh, sorry. I'm so it's sorry. Okay. It's okay. Sorry, sorry everybody. Sorry, okay, sorry. So I think that's like where you're And nice this looking. is one of the things that we're going to do at the retreat, right yes. Janice? You're going to measure everyone. Yes. See, look at so that. that. It's perfect. That looks great. Mm -hmm. But if you went down here uh -huh, uh -huh. Mm -mm. sad mm -mm. but what you could but what i do if i may is let's get it back to that ideal length of mine that's a little bit longer a little longer my second length 
wherever that was. It's right about there, right about there. One of the things that you could do, instead of dragging your pendant, you know, having this pull down, I could put it in, the, yes. I do this all the time. All the time. Yes. Where I move my pendant to the side. Yes. Which I love. Now, also, if I were putting my pendant all the way down here, this gets back to the question of, you know, making things too small. This is where I might lift this a little bit so that the yeah. end of my pendant, pendant is the bottom, is of, your the bottom of my length. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, to get back to the question of the lariat, mm -hmm. the lariat I would make so that where they come together, where you knot them mm -hmm. together, is somewhere along one of those ideal lengths. So if I were using the tape measure even right. as my lariat. Right. I would make the lariat like a uh, it would either somewhere like 20 to 28. So I would. You want that that first. right? So this is where the knot would be, right if, about if there. If you wanted it that long, mm -hmm. yes. So would. I would say that I'm coming around. I'm holding my finger there. So let's say even if I had a lariat that was super long, I would knot it. That's about at my 28 inch length. Right. About right. Right about right there. Right. Right? Mm -hmm. So depending on how long of a tail you want as well, like I don't, I call this like the, you know, the, what is it, well, no man's it's, land or whatever. Well, no, you, you want just, it to go you, underneath. You don't want anything to mm -mm. ever end at your nipples. At your bust line, no. You know, like everyone out there, just <laughs> don't stop or Above start or there. below. Above <laughs> or below. <laughs> right. You know, unless you're like really, really modest is the like not abundant, <laughs> and then you've got that whole canvas to work with. <laughs> right, exactly. But for the rest of us that are a little more ample, stay away from the top from of the, the mountain. <laughs> from the mid range. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. but see, but I can, if I'm below yes. here, yes. I could make the end of my lariat a little bit yes. shorter. Yep that way yep. or I could just have them go like this. Well it doesn't really yeah it doesn't really matter because this is what's talking. Mm -hmm. You so, can go as long right. as you want because that's what the eye sees mm -hmm. is what's up around the neck. Now what you could also do one of the things that we also the way that we do with lariats and let's again pretend that this is this is a 60 inch tape measure. I could for lariats also sometimes when I make a lariat I'll put it through this right way, right and I'll have it so I could have a little stopper it. bead, yeah. right? So it fits me right. right where I want it to be. You could do it with this if you wanted. Mm, someone's asking what is a lariat, and Whitney wants to know if there are going to be notes and videos if you can't make it to the retreat. Well, let's discuss that in just a yes. second. Um, a lariat is a necklace that comes around that's open-ended. Usually it has some kind of a charm on the end or something to weight it down, and you simply, it's like a scarf, but it's a necklace. So I just take my strand of beads, string it through and there's my lariat so it's not a necklace that has a clasp that goes to the back but a necklace that's worn in the front kind of like a scarf mm -hmm. cool we good okay all right so let's address a few questions about sure. the retreat because we've been getting a lot of them okay you want to sit down again yeah okay so just real quick you guys before we sign off um Thank you so much. Well, that was fun. Yeah, I liked it. Fun. Yeah, it was I really fun. That. So let's share a little bit about the retreat. So uh, our retreat signups start on Monday, and there'll be a newsletter that goes out Monday morning that's going to talk all about that. We are going to share a lot of the things that we're doing at the retreat. Um, we want to make it really special for the attendees that are coming. But we'll also do, we're planning on doing some Facebook Live broadcasts right from the retreat. Mm -hmm. Also this summer, as we move our Facebook Lives towards the fall, we do have some special Facebook Lives that are kind of like retreat prep um, that everybody can kind of um, join in on mm -hmm. as well. So we will have some um, kind of you know, small bits and pieces. So those of you who can't join us um, at our lovely retreat area right. will be able to join in. So I hope that helps, that answers questions. So any final questions, Gracie, that we No, got? but a, a pretty cool comment. Mimi says that lariats sometimes look back uh, look better when the hanging the danglies yeah. are in the back. back. Yes. yes, yes, yes. I love that. We're, we we need to add. I lariat. don't really have any occasions where I'm going to wear it back. So, I mean, I you never. Know. I wish I I still did, but I I don't. I don't have any. 
what if galas we, to go what to? If we get, what if we go to a gala? Or what if we get to go to like, maybe there's some kind of big award show for Facebook Live that will be able maybe. to walk the red car carpet. Or, or, or maybe you'll become red famous ready. doing some really cool show. Maybe. You never know what might happen. I know. Oh, Janice. Don't let the cat out of okay. the bag. Okay. Or we'll let or the cat out of the bag soon. Soon. Yeah. Um, hopefully. So, you guys, thanks so yeah. much for Thank joining for us the, on and, Free Tip Friday. Oh, and the birthday wishes. You need to zoom oh, in. and the oh. necklace. Wait, just yeah. keep it on. I'll zoom in. Okay. Okay. So, I've got my little older charm necklace on, but this is what Kate made. Yeah. Just a little array of yeah. charms. A little J, a little vintage little letter Can thing. Can you airbrush out my skin? Oh, Janice, your skin looks great. <laughs> and then that typewriter key that says shift key yeah. is pretty fun. So it was just a little, and all on brass chain, handmade brass And chain. all we said as soon as you brought this in is why aren't we selling these things? Right, like, and so, so we may add, yeah. I don't know if you guys like kind of those kind of cool, funky old charms. And yeah. if you do, we're thinking about actually adding yes. some to our product line, yes. which is really cool. So thanks, Grace, for your amazing hammer work as yes. always. Yes. And thank you, everyone, yes. for joining us and um, being here celebrating my birthday with yeah. me. And have a happy Mother's Day. Yes, happy Mother's Day um, on Sunday. To everybody. Everybody's a mother. Everybody. Everybody. Yeah, like I'm a cat mom. Yeah, everybody mothers somebody. Yes. So that's, go out there and be a mother to somebody. Yeah. And celebrate, good. yeah. Wednesday, we've got a great Facebook Live coming up. As we said, we've got part two mm -hmm. of our Soft Flex journey. Um, episode notes, episode will be notes I was just going to say, Monday. ready on Monday, so you can check the website around noon for those mm -hmm. episode notes. But there'll be a link in your Monday newsletter. Thanks again, you guys, for reaching out, doing all that great stuff. And this weekend, it's the end of our Janice birthday sale, so make sure and check your newsletters. Check your newsletter tomorrow as well because there might be a special giveaway mm. that I'm not going to say, mm. but it, you'll have to learn it tomorrow. It might be green. It might be. So, so on that note, happy Friday, you guys. Happy Thank weekend. You. We'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.